All right, guys, this is going to wrap up Sunday's fun day of uh, chaos and all the packs we are doing. A hobby of 2021. I can probably put together about five sets of the base cards after all that I've opened up with this stuff. Probably more. I wouldn't be surprised. Between the number of tins, the number of uh, these boxes. I think this is my fourth or fifth box of this, by the way, as far as hobby. And I've never, never pulled a curl from this. Uh, I've never pulled a curl young gun, to be honest. You've never pulled a curl young gun? Nope. I've only purchased. I know. Yeah. I know. Okay, I know. I know what you've pulled. And it's not it's not fair. So let's start this off with our first and it's Philippe. And I'm always looking to see if we did get any other type of inserts, because you can of course uh, pull some other parallels, of course the different variations, the day with the cup. Um, and we got our first Dazzler. Could it be a good one? Oh, we got a uh, canvas checklist, too. The K the Kachucks. Philip Roberg and the Dazzler. Let's set that right there. Cancel. I don't know if anybody's... Uh, heard the uh, the announcement but it sounds like there is going to be a uh release on the cup november 14th our next young gun is a steven lorenz uh so yeah i heard the cup is going to be released november 14th and it's already projected to be like 7500 dollars for a case of six and that would put that at $1,250 a box for six cards. And I don't know if I can justify spending that kind of money because there is just no way. I mean, even if you get a Kirill at $1,250, I mean, it's, it's Kirill or bust at that point. So I don't know if I'm even going to bother. That's a cool card. We'll see. I'm just... I think $1,250 is just ridiculous for that. I mean... Gosh, we're already getting down to our next... What is this? Oh, the old peachy. Okay. Let's set that over to the side. I'd like to get a clear cut. Clear cut in here would be great. And portrait. On to the right stack. Another portrait. I don't know about you guys, but let me let me know if any of you guys are actually planning to do the cup. And think about it, if you did even a, a break, a team break or something like that, I, I'm doubting you're going to find many people that will let you buy the team. And if you do, of course, it's going to be crazy expensive and your chances are going to be very, very slim with, you know, even if it's a six box case... I mean, that's six cards <laughs> per total of 36. So, I mean, is it is it really worth trying to fetch? What? We got a paper insert in here. What the hell? Well, 
Well, that's really weird. You ever seen a paper insert in here? It was right on top. With just a, just a top insert. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna doubt that. What do you think, Matt? Should we should we try one box of the cup? <laughs> it is. I just I don't I don't know if it's I can deal with getting 20 out of a $140 box, but a $1,700 box? I know. That's not even, I mean, it's not even, it's so ridiculous that you charge that much for. And we got, okay. Yeah. Austin Pagansky. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, it's. I remember somebody saying something about like, you know, okay, thirty-one teams for this for this year, and you would have to have. I mean, like, even even if you did like a uh, ten spots to have one in three chance of getting the wild. I mean, that's at what three hundred? That's like three thousand dollars just to take that chance, you know. So. I mean, you want to take a three thousand dollar gamble on? It'd be really shitty if you didn't even get the spot. Let alone you know your your chances. I mean, they already they already have it figured out, man. Upper deck has already got all of us on the string, and our young gun Brandon Crawley. I think I'm just not having much luck with this at all. I get screwed over by these boxes. Come on. There's gotta be something worthwhile in here. I got a, I got a clear cut. I got a clear cut. Hey, can we could, could, can it be can it be a, a good clear cut? Yeah, well doesn't mean doesn't mean no it's not it's a regular yeah damn that sucks that sucks who is it jason Spe Spezza or something like that Spezza. that's a waste why even waste the acetate for them I wonder if you could get two in one box. Huh. Now we're done with that last stack. I think they at least give you a little something out of that just for teasing you with a shitty acetate. Victor Olson Canvas. Yeah, this is brutal.
Well, at least I'll be able to put together some of those sets, like I said. Wow. It's just like, I mean, we're supposed to have like eight young ones, I thought, but. Them off. <laughs> oh, God. That's just brutal. to learn from my mistakes and wow what a shit box <laughs> all right guys thanks for checking in have a great day